to my channel. If you don't already know me, I am Katie and I'm a mum of three. And on my channel, I share videos about finding you, finding your style and getting organised while you're at it. I upload every single Sunday, so I would love it if you subscribed joined the community there are links down below to all different groups and channels that you can find me on and also i would love it if you commented down below so that i can get to know you this week i have been focusing on zone three and if you don't know what i'm talking about there is also a link down there so you can get the planner that i use this is how i organize myself organize my housework and zone three is the hall stairs and landing plus the bathroom. So what that means is every single day I spend 15 minutes in those areas. So this week I have already spent 15 minutes doing the hall and the stairs and the landing. It doesn't take much to do those, just mopping it and dusting, getting all the cobwebs and things. And then I'm focusing today on my bathroom. I really want to get this deep cleaned. I clean it on a day-to-day -day basis, which is mentioned in my planner as well. But I really want to give it a deep clean, really get behind the cupboards, dust the pictures, get it properly done. I don't know about your bathroom, but ours just seems to be the dustiest room in the house. I guess it's where it's the condensation, it all sticks to it. But anyways, I clear all the window sills ready to start. Then I get my two cloths, pink for the sink, blue for the loo. I'll use the pink for all of the bathroom and the blue is just for the toilet. I wipe down the window sills, getting all of the grime, all of that dust, and I open the windows just to get some fresh air into the space before putting everything back. We're really trying to cut down on the things that we use. So we have a few products, but we also have dishes of soap that we buy to cut down on plastic. Then I will clear the sink area and wipe down all of the walls because again, just the condensation in the room, just wiping all, all the tiles down. Then I will clean the sink. Again, it just gets so dusty, but this does get cleaned on a day-to-day -day basis anyway, but I'll just give it an extra wipe around while I'm in the room. I also make sure I wipe all the way down the stem of the sink or whatever it's called, just cleaning all around it. Then I will clean all of the bits and bobs and put them back and does anyone else have these my kids really wanted them so now each of us have these hideous things that i can't get rid of because the kids love that we have our names on our toothbrush holders then i'll move over to the bath and i will climb in i actually got soaked doing this i sprayed myself and I will clean all of the tiles again, that condensation build up and just lime scale and I don't know, all sorts of just grime that builds up over the time. And I will clean behind the toys before sticking them back onto the tiles. We live in a hard water area, so our silverware or whatever it's called gets really crusty. So I will make sure I give that a good old wipe around the taps and the shower clean inside the bath, give it a good old spray, clean through, get rid of any hair or whatever just builds up in that shower. And again, that lime scale, it really gets onto our shower screen. Really have to work on that, like scrub it all off. I don't know, it's just the hard water area just is really bad for that. But Viacal is amazing for that if you also live in a hard water area. Get my little window cleaner thing, get that done. And then I will dust those frames and adjust them because they always get wonky before cleaning the unit as well. Now it's time for my blue cloth to do the toilet. So only the blue cloth touches the toilet. It doesn't take toilet germs anywhere else. I do do the toilet every single day, like I said, but I'll just give it a once over while I'm here. And then I will also make sure that I do around the toilet. So I'll do down the sides of the toilet, which I wouldn't do that on a on a day-to-day -day basis. And then a quick wash of my hands. So that is the bathroom done. A nice deep clean because ordinarily on a day-to-day -day basis, I just wipe down the sink as I'm cleaning my teeth and then I wipe down the toilet. But otherwise I wait for the five week cycle to do a deep clean. So I've done the bath, I've done the shower, I've done all of the lime scale that builds up on the shower thing. I've done the photos, the window sills, just a nice deep clean. Ordinarily, I would split it into 15 minute chunks and do a bit over a few days as that's how I 
to do things I'll just do a little bit each day and that adds up to a big job but obviously I wanted to film it for the video all in one go so it has take it's taken me about 45 minutes to do all of that I have still got to hoover and to mop in here but I'm going to do that tomorrow like you don't need to see me mop that's that's enough one day so I will be back next week with another upload bye